The circulatory system carries oxygen and nutrients to your cells. The main parts are blood, heart, and blood vessels. Most of your blood is, is a colorless liquid called plasma. It carries nutrients all around the body. There are three kinds of blood cells. Red blood cells carry oxygen from your lungs throughout your body. White blood cells help to fight germs when you are ill. Platelets help stop bleeding. Bleeding. The heart is a muscle. It has four main parts. The heart's job is to push the blood around the body. Blood vessels are tubes that help blood flow into the body. body. Veins bring back the blood to the heart and arteries bring blood around the body from the heart. Have you ever wondered how your heart and blood works? Well, the heart is the center of it all, because if we didn't have a heart, we wouldn't survive. The heart is made up of four chambers. The top two are called atria, and the bottom two are called ventricles. The heart is like a pump. It receives blood from the body and then pushes it out. First, the atria relax and blood enters them. The right atrium receives blood from the body, and the blood that enters the left is from the lungs. Then, the atria contract. On the left, the mitral valve opens, and on the right, the trisupid valve opens. This lets blood flow into the ventricles. After that, the ventricles contract. On the left, the aortic valve opens, and on the right, the pulmonary valve opens. This lets blood flow out of the heart. When blood leaves the right ventricle, blood goes into the lungs through the pulmonary artery. Now, the blood doesn't just gush into your lungs, you would be upheaving blood. The blood goes into the alveoli, which are tiny fibers that pick up oxygen and other chemicals in the air. In the alveoli, your blood drops off carbon dioxide for you, at, for you to exhale and oxygen that you inhaled. The blood now heads back to your heart. Oxygen-rich blood from the left ventricle leaves your heart through the aortic artery. Once the blood is in your body, it flows down your arteries, which branch off into capillaries. The red blood cells spread out in your capillaries to reach every cell in your body. When a red blood cell reaches a cell, it drops off oxygen and other nutrients that it picked up around the body to feed the cell. Then, the blood cell loses its color and takes waste from the cell. After that, the red blood cell heads up the veins into your heart and the cycle starts again. The heart and blood are both amazing parts of your body and biologists are learning more every day. It's amazing to think about the circulatory system. You should always drink water and milk. Milk is good for the muscles. If you're older than nine, drink three cups of milk. If you're younger than nine, only two. Did you know that when your body works hard during play, you are exercising? During play, your heart breathes faster also. Exercising makes you breathe faster and makes your muscles strong. The circulatory system makes your oxygen and your nutrients in your blood move faster throughout your body. Daily play and exercising helps you reach physical fitness. Those are some of the facts I know.